Hey, go, 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 go back, go back. Go back. What do you want? Go back. Leave here. I'm talking to you. You're watching me. Leave here. What do you want here? What? What? What are you holding? What do you see? Oh, you're a thief. Oh, so you came here to stay. Hey! You are thief! Wait, you are, you are, you are not mad? No. We're running to come watch TV without taking off your uniform. It's not cartoon, Mama. She can see it's not your world. You still can't do this right now, okay? You just got back from school. You have to go up, take off your uniform, take a shower, and take a nap. But just for school, Mom. Huh. As class teacher, give us a project right about. Domestic and wild animals. Interesting. Our class teacher asked us to visit the zoo if we can. But I know you did this as usual. And who said that mommy cannot take our time to take you to the zoo? Hmm? Who said that? I said so. You lie, young man. Look, I will take you to the zoo this holiday for sightseeing. We can? Of course we can! <laughs> You're welcome! So now we have a deal, right? Hmm? Yeah. So now we have a deal. We need to go upstairs and do the right thing. Mm -hmm. Fresh, you know? Take a nap, then you come eat, okay? Okay. Alright, take your bag. Off you go. And be careful! Stop running! Okay. Oh my god, you hurt yourself! I'm so small! I'm a oh. big boy! Yes, yes, calm down. 
Move it. Move it. Move it. Let's go. Yes. Yes. Goodbye. 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 Yeah. Move it. Move it. Move it. Yeah. Goodbye. Yes. I'll buy you candy. Hey. Okay. Hey, Jesus. Did you know what was all this now? Hey, see, look at the time. I bought you here for one purpose, Tika, for one purpose, to tidy up this premises. You know, it was almost eight o'clock. People are coming to visit, and you have not, you have, you have not gone in this place. What's going on? You want me to lose my job? Don't die like that. Casters, casket is very, very scarce now. don't allow you watch those scary cartoons on TV. It makes you have nightmares. But you also have a dreaming about the animals I watched on TV. So what were you dreaming about this time? You saw yourself in an aircraft? Hmm? No, we were inside the car. And the car had an accident. Um, the car smells so too many times and caused fire. It's just, it's just a dream. I'm sure it's just a figment of your imagination from watching too much scary cartoon. It was so real, Mom. People were screaming and running to help us. But it's not real. It's just a dream. Hmm? You don't need to be afraid, okay? Did you say your prayers before going to bed? You see? You see why I always tell you to say your prayers before you sleep? Alright, come on, let's pray. Okay? Let us pray.
I'm coming. question last week <laughs> and I said yes trust me I have been so so excited I can imagine <laughs> I couldn't even wait to share the good news with you you have no idea how I have been able to keep this news all to myself <sighs> let me see that let me see that oh this is so beautiful I'm happy for you thank you I know right <laughs> <laughs> I just um, wish I'm as lucky as you are sometimes Come on, Scarlett. Having a man in your life doesn't equal happiness. I was talking like I've not been married before. If only he didn't leave. I get lonely sometimes. It's, it's not easy. Scarlett. You have been the strongest woman that I have known all my life. Don't give up on love. Trust me, you will find the one. A man who will love you for you. Okay, so just get off this mood. Okay, thank you. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. And we have a look at this ring again. Oh, oh my, my god. Yeah. I am so happy. This is beautiful. Oh, let's Jerry. I've got really nice things. I hope okay, you got nice something, something for me as well. No way. Are you yours is your case. You just have to you start. You know that song, right? Now, <laughs> <laughs> Jack, nothing for me. So is engaged. I Turn around for mommy. Oh, look at this man. Wait, isn't this the outfit Auntie Dobra got for you? Uh, we're going to a zoo, not a party. Okay. Well, mom, this is the outfit I chose to wear. Look, I promised Auntie Dobra that I'll take some pictures in them for her. Okay. You win, as usual. Okay? You're wearing them, it's fine. You win. I'll let you win. Crying. No. Why? You have tears in your eyes. No, I don't. I nothing. This is something went into my eyes. I was trying to take it off. Why are you looking at me like that? No, you crying because you missed Uncle Ted. No. I told you something went into my eyes and I was taking it off. That's all. And why do you think I miss Uncle? Too. I wish Dad didn't go to heaven just yet. He would have been here with us and we wouldn't have missed Uncle Ted so much. But you know heaven is a better place, right? So you can go join him there. Mm -mm. He's going to come join us here. Can someone go to heaven? And oh heaven? my God, not today. Can we go? We need to go before he gets back, okay? Okay. Enough of the questions. Let's go. Your glasses. You see? All right, let's go. <laughs> Too many questions. Jerry.
Hello, we want tickets. Yeah. Thank you. So this is yours, this is mine. Okay. Let's go. Yeah, I'm in the zoo. I'm in the zoo. Yeah, I'm welcome to Children's <laughs> National Park. I'm I was dancing. I am Emos, okay. your guide for this tour. This way. Okay. All right. Like your glasses looking beautiful. This is thank you. <laughs> <laughs> it's not so like it's crazy. We've got a whole lot of beautiful creatures. Wow. Yeah. Yes. Beautiful okay. creatures. Well, can I? Yeah, come yeah, on. Sure. Sure. Bring that, let me keep it. Let me hold this. Right. Yay! <sighs> Wow. Wow, that's so nice. Let me take a picture of you. Woo, look at that. Wow. That is so fine. Okay, that's enough. That's enough. Let's go see that. Ah, yeah, let's, go. let's go. Yay! Let me go show you some beautiful creatures that we've like got that? here. Duck. I yeah. like those ducks. They're so colorful. Yeah. <laughs> wow. And there's a river in the cave. You know, remember I well, told you, this dog is so I was going to show you so, 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 so tall. A whole lot of lovely, what? beautiful creatures. Tortoise, tortoise, and wow, this. Oh, I uh, see your lion now. Wow, lion, that's a lion, wow, that's <laughs> lion, lion. Wow, wow, that's a lion. Wow! Oh, that's a lion! Look, that's a lion! Wow! Very big, right? Me! <laughs> wow! The tree! Yeah! Wow! I oh, should smile! Wow! I'm just gonna take a picture! I have, I'm taking pictures yeah. already! Oh, I don't want to share a spirit on my mouth! A king cannot share his throne with his subjects! Huh? Remember the lion is the king of the jungle. Oh. Yeah. So that is why the lion is alone. Huh. Oh. So now you've seen a lion, right? Yes. I'm happy. Uh. Look at that. This is the crocodile. Whoa, those are the crocodile. What? Yeah, is that one alive? Yes, it is. But it seems it's not. No, it's alive. You mean you've not seen a crocodile before? But I thought crocodiles can stay out of water. No. Oh, that's a misconception. Crocodiles can stay out of water as long as they will. Um and you know, uh you know crocs um are reptiles. They basically live in water. And then um Here, yeah, there is water in their cage. Just as you can see, actually divided. Um, this is land and uh, this is water. So, you know, they, they can still get back to the water whenever they feel like getting back to the water. It's not really like... Uh...
Where is my son? My son, Jerry, one little boy. Did you see him? No, Are you sure? Back, Please, I'm looking for my son. One little boy. No, he has something on his face. Where is it? Where is my son? Where is my son? No, kid, can you be back? Ah! 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 Just to clean her hair. You look so messy to yourself. Why don't you clean up some? Because I need money to do that. You just said you're cleaner. Don't you get paid? I get tips from kind visitors. Thank you. You're very kind. Don't you have friends? You just said I'm dirty. Have you seen anybody who wants to be friends with you like me? But everyone has friends. And my teacher said all of us need friends. Just like... And to Deborah is my mom's friend. I have a friend called E.K. in school. So why don't you have any friend? Are you always this inquisitive? You've asked me a lot of questions in a few minutes. Is that a bad behavior? I don't have friends. Okay. Where did you leave your mother? So she's very worried about you right now. Ah, oh, dear. At the crocodiles. I think you have to find her now. Okay. Bye bye. I don't say bye bye like that. Uh, how do you say bye? I do a head bump. What's a head bump? When I give my head. Bump yours. Okay. Bump. Come here. Mm. Mm. One guy told me around. You know how kids behave. I mean, he, he, he was with me. And then all of it was. Oh my god! 
Where have you been? I've been looking everywhere for you. Where have you been? Oh my God. What are you doing with this madman? He's not a madman, his name is Ted. He's a madman! He's not mad. He are you okay? Us. Did he hurt you? Come, let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Are you okay? Us. Food, food is life. Food is life. <laughs> Nimi. 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 That cleaner is beginning to pose as a problem to the visitors. I don't care whatever his name is. I mean, I thought some one of you was supposed to have given him money for his cleanup. No, me, no, nobody gave me money. Oh. Nobody gave me money because he can't be walking around the park looking like a madman. I mean, he needs to get shaved up before he starts attracting the attention of fire authorities. You know, the park doesn't have enough cleaners here. So, actually need him, but he needs to, to, to get cleaned up, he needs to, 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 to shave okay. up. So, I'm going to give you some money so you, 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 you get him cleaned up, oh. get him shaved up. Okay. Yes, please, make sure you do that. Wanky. Yes. Wanky. Just make sure you oh. clean him up. That's my own. Imagine the concombility. No, just, just imagine the concombility. Oh, really? So, for your mind now, you have given me one key. I should, I should give to Tega. So that Tega will go and shave. Tega will go and shave his, his, his handprint. Oh, really? Really? What? I mean, I mean I'm, I'm working here over three, three, three weeks now, three months. They have not paid a salary. You want me to go and give this, this, this money money to, 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 to Tega? So that Tega Tega will look fresh. D don't worry. I'll give to Tega. Tega will, I will give Tega will give us nice mohawk. Nice punk. Imagine the oh yeah, my major. Jo, jo, koto mami jo. Are famanti monze. Imagine the concomitants, the authorities. For over, over, over three months now, they've not paid us. Why are you picking your food? Why are you sulking? Do not me say goodbye to my friend. And who is your friend again? Someone that looks so unkept and dirty. You don't even know him. His name is Tega. So you think because you know someone's name, that means you know the person? But you called him a madman. The tall guy said he's not mad. How was I supposed to know he's not mad? Do I have superpowers? His appearance says otherwise. But I just wanted to say goodbye. I didn't even get to see the other animals. Now, what about my school projects? Maybe if you did not wander away and got me so worried and troubled, you'd have seen other animals. <laughs> We're not doing this today. I know I always let you win, but not today, okay? Look, you can ask me any question you want to know about animals, domestic animals, wild animals, any question, I'll answer it, okay? When you start your project, I'll be there for you. But for now, eat your food. Eat. Eat, come on, go ahead. 
But I don't want to have friends. And my teacher said all of us need friends. So, Tika, wait, oh, I want to understand. Why is it that you are always tearing the waters? You are always watching. I, I said it. I said it. The first time you came here, I was suspecting you that this, this Tika now, you, you, you will be Mama Water's daughter. Yes. Because you are always behaving, behaving like a fish. And you look scary too. Always afraid. Phil Waters. Gives me a glimpse of hope. But I will find myself again. Hey. Don't suffer. Come and dance. Now on me. Jesus. See, see, uh, uh, Tiga. I've been I've been having complaints. I've been I've been hearing that you've been talking to visitors. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. This is not what me and you agreed. I don't like this. This is not what me and you agree. We agree that anytime you see visitor, hide your face. Hide your face. And what's all this now? Are you are you as well? And I was even telling you that you look dirty. Look at look at all you, 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 your your don't. Are, are, you, are you a small boy? And because of you, since the day you came here, fresh guests don't come here again. Only ugly guests. Because you look ugly, you, 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 are, you are sucking the fresh guests away. You understand? Fresh guests will not be coming. Eh? What's all this? I don't like this. I've told you that don't be don't don't be showing yourself. Hide your face when you see visitors. You will not. You'll be talking to visitors. You be you you do you want me to lose my job? See if I lose my job, you also lose your job. Oh. If I lose my job, you also lose your job. What's all this now? Please, please, Tiga. What you are doing? I don't want to act like I'm 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 a rude person. Please, I don't want to receive this complaint again. Because if I receive this complaint, I don't have any church than, than, than to, 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 to sack you. Plenty of people are calling me. Oh. Plenty of people are calling me to work at the zoo. Ola me dear Potabu and Rima them. All of them, they are calling me. If you like, call Potabu and ask Potabu that if he's not worrying me with course, he wants to work at the zoo. Call Potabu, call Ola me dear. What's all this? I'm done. Have you given this man his salary? Madonna. Uh, did you? Madonna. Don't I feed him? I feed him, so that's enough. Oh. Hmm. You feed him, but uh, this work is very hard. And I don't know why he will stay without payment. Uh, well, he doesn't have any option. If he had, he had uh, other option, will, will, will he be here? Will he be here? Try give him his money. There is something very strange about him. He doesn't talk. Uh, see, that thing is uh, my, 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 my hours are over. Okay. Please make sure you keep an eye on him. Because I don't want the visitor to be complaining. Okay. So please keep an eye on him for me. I don't want to hear visitor complaining that we have a madman here. Watch it. Okay. I will I will do as you say. Your secret are saved. But try give her me money. Oh. Eh? Nothing, nothing. Ah. So.
babe, what's up now? Is the food not ready yet? I'm very hungry. Should have eaten in your house before coming. It's not yes. even 10 a.m. yet. I know. But the worms in my stomach are already screaming. You are, I guess, who called? Who? Ted. <laughs> Who's Ted? Oh, yes. Ted. Ted. Yes, he called. <laughs> Funny. So did he tell you his reason for disappearing on you? He didn't say much over the phone, but he wants us to meet up and talk tomorrow. No way. Scarlett, do not tell me that you are considering meeting with that guy. Not a single word from him for over three months. He blocked you on all social media platforms. Blocked your numbers. And now he suddenly wants to talk to you. Who does that? I know, look, I am mad at him. I am so, so mad at him and you know that. I want to see him. I want to know what made him disappear on me. No. I don't think you should. It is not a good idea. Honestly, see, this same guy didn't reach you before. He didn't reach you enough to tell you why he disappeared on you. I am very certain that he does not have anything reasonable to say to you. Trust me. I, I want closure. I want to know. I need to see him. Honestly, that's the only thing in my head right now, to see him. I'm gonna come back again, again, again. I'm gonna come back again. I give it like that, 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 that. See, you don't go feel, you don't go, you don't go, you don't go feel water. Now, which water are we going to use to, 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 to flush the toilet? Eh? It's not good. We're feeling the, 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 the water. Uh -uh. I won't, I won't visit the washroom now. Wait, wait, wait. wait. No, no, I don't like. Hmm. Huh? You got? Take away, are you going? Going to look for a job. What do you say? Come again. Going to look for a job. <laughs> hey! I'm gonna come back again. I'm gonna come back again. I give you a like da, 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 da. <laughs> okay, no, wait. Chiga, for your mind now, you think you're a hot cake. Eh? No, tell me which, 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 which job owner, which work owner in his right senses will employ you like this? The way you are looking like this. How dirty you are looking. Look at how dirty you are looking. Look at how dirty you looking like a madman. You are going to look for a job for a man now you are hot cake. <laughs> you know, Tiga, when you came here the first time, you know, I saw you as a madman. But when you started speaking, I was like, okay, maybe he's not a madman. But no, I finalize it. You are a madman. You are going to look for, for, for a job holding a lady's back. Okay, you are dressed, you are a quad dresser. Oh, okay, you do part-time gay. Oh, really? Okay, see, Tiga, if you don't know, let me tell you once, since you don't have a phone, the government is catching, clearing all mad people in this country. They are taking them to the psychiatric hospital. Oh, yes. And you see all these small smokers, all these, all these Yahoo boys, they are catching mad people. They will use your liver, your liver now. They will catch your liver. Yes. They will use your liver for you to I'm telling you. Okay, you don't know. You don't know. Oh no, wait, no, stand there, stand there. What am I even, even it's not like I'm 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 stopping your your your, your destiny, yo. I don't want to stop your psychiatric destiny. Just come and go. Uh -huh. if you don't Shut. Beautiful as always. You are obviously still very mad at me. Well, I deserve to go through my enemies. I'm listening. Well, my conscience hasn't stopped pricking me ever since I left without saying a word to you. I just had to come clear. 
So tell me, what happened? Why did you leave? I just can't deal with it anymore. I mean, the fact that you can no longer be a children breaks my heart so bad. But I, I made everything known to you from the onset. I told you everything. And you told me you were okay with it. Now we dated for a year, it's, 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 it's a problem now. Yes, Khaled. It is a problem. I just didn't think about it properly from the beginning. Come on, Scarlett. Don't, 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 don't be selfish. I mean, you have a son. What about me? I won't be able to have children of my own. So that's, that's why you left without a word, just like that? We would have had this conversation and, and gotten on the common ground. What common ground? What? You letting me have children with another woman while we're still married? Come on, it's pointless. Yes. Because <sighs> I can't. Well, um, anyways, I just don't want you to see me as a jerk when you hear about my marriage. So I decided to give you the honor of telling you myself. <laughs> Come. So you disappear for three whole months and all of a sudden you're getting married to another woman. You've been two timing me all this while. And you call me here to humiliate me and tell me this. You are the most insensitive person I've ever met. How could you? What kind of a person are you? God. My son, I want to stop. Okay. Mm. Stop. You don't have. Wait. <laughs> kick, kick, kick. Ta -ta. Uh, pick two. Pick two. I still, I'll still win you. See this okay. game. I'll win. Give me pick four. Hi. Mm -hmm. Welcome. <laughs> um, you know what, sweetie? Keep playing the game while I go find out what is wrong with mommy, okay? I'm coming with you. No, 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 don't come with me. I'm sure mommy won't like this. It's adult talk. Just keep playing. Okay. By the time I return, <sighs> better get prepared. Else. I will whip your ass. You cannot. You cannot. No, no, no. I don't, don't cheat. You if you cheat, I will know. Just You're not keep me. I'll be back. You're capable of nothing. I'm waiting. Why are you This was a bad idea all along. What happened? Ted left me for the same reason. And Jeff did the same thing too. I told you no man is going to want me because I can't have kids. I told you. First, it was my husband that left. Now, Ted. Now, Ted is going ahead to get married to another woman that can bear him kids. It's okay, it's fine. It's okay. It's not okay. Stop telling me it's okay. It's not okay. It's not. I'm gonna leave and die a lonely woman, no husband. Don't say that, Scarlett. You have a son, for God's sake. You have a son. And who says I can't have more children? Why can't I? I really do not know, but if you ask me honestly, I will say Jerry should be your major concern right now. So that if any man doesn't find you worthy enough to be with them just because you cannot bear children, then they should go to hell and remain there. I don't, I don't blame this man. I don't blame them. Look, every man wants to have children. I know. But there is the surrogacy option. They 
just don't love you enough to go through this with you. And that's it. Sweetheart, I do not want you to rule out the opportunity of finding a man that will love you and Jerry like his. No matter what it takes, no matter what you're going through. Okay? Scarlett, I hate to see you like this. Stop beating yourself up too much. I know! And that's why I'm here for you. I, it's okay, it's okay. I, I wouldn't want Jerry to walk in here and see you like this. What do I do? What do I do? It's okay, Scarlett. It's okay. So baby, I was going through your animal projects scores and I can see you made mommy proud. That was a very good one. High five. Mm. I'm so proud of you. Okay. So tomorrow is Valentine's Day and Valentine's Day is a day to share love and show love with your loved ones. So I'm going to get you a gift for Valentine and I also get you a gift for a good project score. Thanks, ma'am. You're welcome. So tell me, where do you want me to take you to? Uh, Valentine is a time of sharing, right? Yes, it is. Uh, I want to share with my friend. That means that will be in school on Monday. No. Not Ike. My new friend at the zoo. I want to give him some presents. I thought we'd forgotten about that. Come on now, Jerry. I thought you were going to say, oh, take me to the cinema or take me to go bowling and... Are we back there again? Uh, but I'm his only friend. <sighs> okay, so what do you want to give to him? Mm, a shirt. How do you even know his size? How are you even sure he's still there? Jerry, this is a bad idea. Very bad idea. Please. Let's try. No, it's a bad idea. Please. Okay. Okay. You win as usual. We'll try. Okay. And that's because you did very good in the animal projects. That's why I'm agreeing to this. Okay. For two. Now hold it. Okay. All right. Let's go. Hey, Jerry! Jerry! Will you wait? Jerry! I told you, he's not here anymore. He wants that gun. He's not here. Let's just see. This is a little But that's, there's nobody here. He's gone. 
Let's go, please. Good afternoon, sir. Yeah, afternoon, madam. Please, we're looking for one man. He walks here. He he has very bushy beards and looks unkept with really dirty clothes. We saw him the last time we were here. Sorry, madam. I don't know anyone here like that. Are you sure? We we saw him here. No, I don't think that type of person is here. Okay, thank you. I told you. Let's go. Sorry, huh? But you don't know that for sure. Let's go, but can't you see? They can't find him. Let's go. I told you. Excuse me. Hello. Excuse me. Come. Hello, meet me. Yes, please. Oh. Oh, good. Please, um, we're looking for this. There's this man that walks here. We saw him the last time we were here. He's very um dirty kind of with very old dirty clothes with bushy hair and unkept beards we saw him the last time we were here oh really yes <laughs> what a bombshell listen you see the thing is uh, the only bushy and heavy people here are the lions you understand we don't have such people here you know we so, we we saw him the last time we were here, the last time we here. Uh, please please excuse me please who are you guys please we we, we are just um visitors and my it's Valentine's Day and my son insisted we bring him this this gift. It's clothes. Oh, it's clothes. Yeah. Vows Day clothes. Oh, okay. Vows Day. Vows Day. Chocolate Day. No problem. You know, if it's just clothes, it's no problem. Just you can handle it to me. I will, I will deliver. You know, I love to do dirty works. Me, me and dirty works. We are like this. Five and six. Um, um. Please, we, my son would really be glad. He insisted we come here. Valentine mm. boy, what a bombshell. See, all right, no problem. All right, no problem. You, you guys can follow me. Oh, really? Mm. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Very much. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. Thank you so much. Yeah, 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 down there. Yeah, down there. Yeah, there. So when you meet the giraffe, Unko, okay, feed them. <laughs> all right. Yeah, those are the people that feed, you know, the animals. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> come on, look. Mommy, come on, look. Mommy, come on, down. Mommy, careful, you know, <laughs> the lions. Sometimes they can, you know, yeah. Okay, ma. So, this is him. Hi, um, I'm Scarlett. I'm Jerry's mom. I'm sorry about the other day. Don't worry. No. I'll take care of it. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. We call it Argentina. Mr. Tinder, 
You need to get changed into the clothes we just got you. We need to go get you cleaned up. He insists. <sighs> Woman, God, how you are looking there? That is, you, you have to bath. Bath be bathing now. Hey, don't be doing this. Yeah, huh? you should have also told him to have a bath. Hey, Valentine boy, Valentine boy, you are doing me watch and learn. Valentine boy, you are doing me watch and learn. Yeah, hey, what a bombshell. Hey, Tiga, don't give any clothes. Hello. Oh, good afternoon. Good afternoon. You're welcome. Thank you. He needs a haircut. Oh, long overdue. Yeah. yeah please sit. Just follow me.
we are. Thank you. You're welcome. So you can't say bye bye. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Look at what I'm seeing. Oh, okay, you got a new haircut. Oh, really? So for your mind now, you are looking fine. For your mind, you have, you have gotten a new haircut. Punk! <laughs> but for your mind, you think you look like C. Ronaldo? No, you are looking like Balotelli. I'm telling you, have you shaved your armpit? Let, let. Jesus! Jesus! Yeah, look, 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 look at how you are smelling now. Have you shaved your armpit? I'm telling you, for your mind, you think like you, you look like C. Ronaldo. You are looking like Balotelli, I'm telling you. Yes, that's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. See, Tega? Tega? If you go there, make sure you don't touch anything. I'm telling you. Don't touch my bucket. Don't touch my soap. When, when, you, when, you, when, you, when you go there, bath alone. Use another man's bucket to bath. I'm telling you. Eh, eh, and make sure you don't touch my mattress. Oh. Don't be touching my mattress. What, what a bomb, sir. Be buying your own mattress. I can't, I can't be allowing you to sleep on my mattress. Finally. <sighs> Where is your gate man? Do you know I've been knocking on this gate for over 30 minutes? I'm sorry, he left. He said he's relocating. He did. I'm on a story. That guy don't get another job. Trust <laughs> me. That's how they behave once they get a new job, they'll tell you one relocation story or the other. That's that's it's how crazy. it is. Crazy. Uh, oh, 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 why don't you get someone from your village to do the job? I've been trying to get someone from the agency, but to no avail. Nobody wants to work these days. Oh. I think I know someone that will be very, very suitable for this job. Mm -hmm. The guy from the park, the one I told you about. Oh, yeah. The guy you took out to get his shape on Valentine's Day, right? Exactly. And so why are you wasting time? Get him though. I'm going to do that because I can't keep opening this gate up. Yeah. Where's my godson? <clears throat> He's not back home yet. Come and dance. Ma, homie. Come and dance. Ma, homie. What the mom said? Ma, I'm telling you. Tega. Tega is getting out of hand. I'm telling you. This guy is very dangerous now. Monkey food. Monkey food go finish. Lion food, Lion food go finish. I realized that he was the one eating all of them. You understand? The guy is very dangerous now. You have to distance yourself. Very, very far from him. Yes, mm -hmm. he's very dangerous. The madness, do you know? He's mad though. I thought it was a joke when he came. But now, the madness is getting serious. So please, it's, it's not good for your health. You have to distance yourself from him. You know? You're fine, woman. It's, it's okay. Maybe I'll just go and come back next time, okay? But, but uh, 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 ma, you see, but if, if you have anything that you want me to get across, I can do it for you. Don't worry, you can use me as your DHL. I no, will no, deliver no. it. It's nothing serious. I just wanted to ask him if he would want to work for me. That's all. Come here, I wanted to ask him if he would want to work for me. Shall That's I come here? All. Like, I have a job for him. I don't know if he would want to. You have a, you have a job? No, ma, ma, no, come on. I can't can work for you. I can't work no, for you. Well, you you have a job already. Me? No, I'm not working, no. I'm not working, ma. This this place as I'm standing here is my soul. My body is not here, I'm telling you. It's my soul that is standing here. I don't have work. This place, they don't pay me where. They don't pay a salary. You understand? So I can't do anything it's, for you. It's fine, okay. Uh, uh, come back, come on. Uh, uh, come back. <laughs> oh, there he is. I've been waiting for you for a while now. Where have you been? 
I uh, I want to look for a job. A job? Really? Actually, that's that's why I'm here. Yeah, I have a job for you. You have a job for me? Yes, I I need a gate man. Let me explain to you, like, in detail what I really want to. So, I live in a house alone, and I, my gate man quits, so I need a new one. So I imagine, I don't know if it's something you want. Welcome, this is my home. And your job is to mind the gates, you know, just... That's how you... That's it, it's, it's very easy. I'll, I'll show you how to do it. So like I explained earlier, all you need to do is mind the gates and take care of the compound, that's all. The compound hasn't been cleaned since the last gate man left, so you have a lot of work to do. And you will stay over there. Here is the key, like I said, all you need to do, you touch this and it opens and same button to close. Very easy, just like I did. My son will be very happy to see you when he gets back from school. I'm going to go pick him up now. So, you're welcome. That's where you're staying. Okay? Thank you. Um, that, that bag, why, why don't you want to do away with it? It looks very dirty and old. I believe it belongs to some people I know. I don't know if like who, who owns it. Do you have any family member or relation or somebody, like someone you know, somebody you know? Any family? Oh, it's fine. It's okay. All right, help me with the gate, just like I thought you. Thank you. Mr. Tega is our new gate man. Wow! Step me is not going to go. 
but back. He's not going back. He's here with us now. Yes! Come on, let's go. Wait, wait, wait. Do not tell me that that man that I saw outside is Tega. Talk now, why are you, why are you smiling? <clears throat> if you had seen him before the cleanup, you would change that adjective you just used. Ooh. Even I, I could not believe he could look that good. Oh my Telling goodness. Me. <laughs> that guy is so cute. I, he's so handsome. So handsome to, to, to be doing the job of a gay man. <laughs> oh. But wait. Doesn't he have any family member? So he said. Said he doesn't have any. <laughs> <laughs> See how fine Bobo chose the waste. <laughs> just the waste in freshness. Anyway. You know I... I wish I was still single. <sighs> Please, how are the wedding plans going? <sighs> My dear, it hasn't been as easy as I thought. You know, but what would I do now? I can't kill myself. I'll just take it one step at a time. You better enjoy the moment while it lasts. Because I know a million and one women would want to be in your shoes. They would die to be in your shoes. You're getting married to a man that loves you. <sighs> I know. It's, it's not like I'm praying for anything bad to happen. But didn't Elijah love you? He loved you before he married you, right? But he left because of little trouble here and there. He left you. For me, I think what really matters is finding someone who will stand by you no matter what, no matter the challenges. And I think Kizito is the man for you. <laughs> I pray. Anyways, the reason I came here is because I want you to accompany me to my tailor's place so I can select a fabric. I don't know. I'm really confused. I want you to help worry. me choose. Because it's already done. I already saved some really good and trendy designs off Instagram. And you did not send they anyone to show me. You. you would Why? love them. The color and everything is on point. Yeah. 
What kind of connection is this between them? his stare have such a great effect on me? Baby. What is it? I dreamt about some accidents again. Oh, babe, come, 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 come. I'm so sorry. Come to mommy. Come. So sorry. Come. You can share mommy's bed, okay? I'm so sorry. Promise the dreams will stop coming. You just outgrow them, okay? Now, okay. Sleep, huh? Say good night to mommy. Good night. Good night, love. I told you already. That's a new shirt. It looks good on you. Thank you. I bought it with my salary. You look fabulous, boy. What's the occasion? Today's the the brass wedding. Oh, that sounds fun. Are you gonna have fun? Yes, I so, will have fun. What's your mother? My mother is still getting dressed. She's getting dressed. Yes. Hey, you see this? What happened? Mm. My mom said 
that guy has a mirror cut. Shall I know small? Two years. Um, mirror cut? Yes. That must be painful. So, tell me, where's your daddy? Mom say my dad is in heaven. Oh, heaven, heaven is a good place. I know. Uh, Uncle Ted used to be my father, but he left us, I guess, he and my mom fought. Uncle who? Uncle Ted. Good morning, Tiga. Get the gates. Let's go, Jerry. I'm going, 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 going. Going, going. Get the gates.
Thank you so much. I don't know if it's my place to tell you this. Tell me what? This morning, you look very beautiful. Thank you. Good night. Um, I have to go. Good night. Guy, Luca. Lucas! Lucas! Who is Lucas? That man's name is Tega. He is not Lucas. He's Scarlet's gay man. What are you telling me? That's my friend. We go way back. Wait! Hey, Lucas, man! <laughs> Look at you. You don't even age. I don't like this thing you did. Wait, so you're in town and you didn't call me. Give me your hand, Joe! What are you still waiting for? Lucas! <laughs> Look, I, 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 I demand an apology from you, I swear, man. You even bought a house? A whole house! You didn't call me! <laughs> this... Not Lucas. He's a gate man. He walks here. <laughs> are you joking with me? This is my friend. What are you saying? Guy, look, say something now. Say something. Is it? Yes! Did you hear? Yes, it's me. So what's up? Look, I deserve an apology, bro. I am not going to take. How can you be in town? Town? And I didn't know why. Wait, what's <laughs> what's what's going on here? I don't know what's going on. I'm confused. Lucas. Wait, are you guys, is this a prank? <laughs> okay, this has got to be a prank, right? Okay, look bro, if this was an attempt to surprise me, you failed woefully. So, Lucas, where's your wife? No, what? What wife? wife? And why are you calling him Lucas? Uh, and your son, where are they? What Where's wife? your wife and your son? What are you saying? What wife and son? I'm Lucas. Yes, well, what are you saying? I'm Lucas. Where's Lucas, where are you going? Wait, wait, what's, what's, what's going, going on? on? What do you what's mean wife and son? He has a wife and a son. Here. That's his wife and his kid. When they took this picture, the boy was two years, having his two-year-old um, birthday celebration. Look at what's going on.
people know of this driving past and I saw him crawling out from a damaged vehicle. An accident, a ghastly one. Could you please just move this? Could you please move this thing and we'll talk about that later? Where? Account, who's there? Okay, you're the young man that brought in the accident victim. Uh, who is he? I'm really sorry. We, we, we tried our best to save him. Yes, but he went into a coma. Oh, God. God, 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 God. Uh, you should try and contact any of his family members so we can take it off from there. Family members? But I told you, doctor, I don't know this guy from anywhere. I only helped him. I saw him and I helped as a good Samaritan. Do I contact his family from? You know, I think he should uh, probably go back to the accident uh, scene. Oh, uh, I could find something there, maybe his ID card or anything belonging to him. That's a point. That's a point. Ah, I'm going there. Okay, okay. Okay, I think I'll do, I'll do just that, yeah. doctor. I'll do just that. If there's any other thing you want me to do, please just let me know. Okay, sure, sure, I really no appreciate it. Thank no you problem. so much. Hey, hey. Please, do come back. No, trust me. You have done something good and uh, the Lord will reward you. It's for humanity anyways. Thank oh. you. Thank God. Right. Thank you so much. It's okay. Thank you. It's okay. Thank you. I'll see you. All right. Doctor. All right. This handsome baby. And it's all over his face. Yeah, I believe he just resumed the work. Yes. This child was brought in here this morning with a mom by some good Samaritan. But it was so unfortunate the mom died a few hours ago. Ah! So sad. Just like that. Yeah. In fact, the people that brought them in here this morning said it was a terrible accident. Two men died at the spot. I believe one of those men should be his dad. Oh, what a loss. Mm. So this child is the only survivor. Then who pays the bill? Well, one of the women that brought them here made the payments. She's yet to return. Oh, what an unfortunate thing. I pray someone comes for him. Yeah. We just have to pray he get recovered. Okay, man. Uh. Oh, Mr. Clement, you are here. Yeah. Sorry, I was running to attend to a patient. Uh, please sit down. Sorry, thank you. So, any useful information about who he is yet? Not really, not really. But um, I was able to get this item from the accident scene. And I um, think some persons got there before me and um, they went to me at some point. Like, I was able to get this. Lost things, doctor. Lost things. Yeah. Something horrible. Look at this. Ah, this is great. This belongs to a child, obviously. Like this by a woman. It's really, 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 really typical. It's quite unfortunate. I wonder why some people seize the opportunity to steal whenever there is an accident. Bad times. I can't, I can't get it. Bad times, doctor. Just bad times. Well, let's hope he doesn't stay in coma for too long. When he wakes up, he'll be able to help us locate his family. Yes. Wow. It's all right. I think you should go home and uh, find some time to rest. And, and please, don't forget to check in tomorrow. All right, Doctor. I will step off. And again, Doctor, um, thank you so much. I really appreciate you being, you being like a lifesaver and a God reward you for all your efforts. Amen. And well, that's the least we can do for humanity. Yeah, that is what we are trained to do. So and uh, hopefully, this is this a reality? Oh, okay. Okay, okay. I'll give them for our friends. Sorry about it. Just let me take that. It's all right. Thank you. And again, Doctor, thank you so much. 
We are trained for this, so we keep doing this always. And please don't forget to check in tomorrow. It's definitely. <laughs> at least at least I can do it. As long as we are here, we we'll keep doing this. Please. Oh really? Thank you. <laughs> yes, it's 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 never enough. So <laughs> we'll keep, we'll keep doing it. Too. It's all right. Thank you so much. Uh, I look forward to seeing you tomorrow. All right. All right. My regards to the crew. Oh yes, I'll do so. I'll do so. Thank you. I'm tired, doctor. At this point, I'm tired. I can't keep paying the bills of someone I don't know. I can't. And it's been lying there for the past three months, doing nothing, wasting my money. I'm tired. Or maybe he's even dead, who knows? Come on, don't be ridiculous. He is not dead. I don't care. Doctor, at this point, I don't care. I can't keep paying the bills of someone I don't know. I can't. Look, I need you to calm down. I mean, I understand how devastating this is with you. But don't worry. The family is going to reimburse you every money you've spent when he finally wakes up. When will he ever wake up? Doctor, when will he ever wake up? This guy has been lying down there for the past three months. Lying down, wasting my money. When will he ever? I was only trying to be a good man, Doctor. I was just trying to be a good Samaritan. Just what we were taught in church. How, what wrong have I done? Just this morning, just look at, look at. Just take a look at this message. That's from my kid brother. He needs money. Doctor, money. I can't even keep on with my own front because of this man that I don't know from anywhere. I'm tired. My tired is tired, doctor, I'm tired. Uh, I, I totally understand you, all right? I understand. I mean, the hospital has also been helping with paying his bills from the charity trust fund. It's not been easy with us too. <sighs> well, there is really no much we can do right now. Except you want us to take him out of life support. Better. Doctor, better. If that will save me, my head, better. <sighs> and my pocket, better, doctor. Because <laughs> at this point, I'm tired. I, I understand, but you need to calm down, all right? Oh. Uh, I mean, why, why do I have this feeling that this is the last time we might be seeing you around here? Doctor, well, you have my number. Don't you have my number? I gave you my number the last time, which you dialed, and it went through. I, I, I do have your number, but calls can be ignored sometimes. Doctor, whatever, I'm tired. Just <laughs> do what you have to do, I'm tired. It's okay, I understand. Let's hope he, he wakes up soon, all right? God's willing. We'll, we'll, we'll go through this well. Okay. It's alright. Tired. Tired. Oh. really happened after the accident? I don't know. 
I woke up at the hospital. The doctor said I was in a coma for seven months. Wow. Do you remember anything at all? The young man that brought you was hoping that you'd be able to locate your family and then settle some of the beams. He had abandoned you long ago. I can remember the disappointment on the doctor's face when he realized I lost my memory. He told me the good Samaritan who brought me there had abandoned me. They were hoping my family would come pay the rest of the bill. He gave me the items recovered from the accident scene, hoping they would help me remember anything, but it was fruitless. My brain had been faulted. I was sent out of the hospital weeks later after no one recognized the picture of me they posted everywhere. I mean, I was living in the States, so no one really knew me here. I didn't know anyone or anywhere. I was battling with my mind trying to remember who I was. But something was always by my side. At night, I'll return to sleep at the hospital's gate. I slept there so many cold nights without food. One night, a woman had compassion on me. She asked me who I was and if I had no home. As usual, I had no tangible answer. She took me home with her. She called me Tega, and that became my name. She was a food seller and I worked for her for a very long time. Until her husband saw me as a problem. He didn't want a grown man like me in his house anymore. I was sent into the streets yet again. I lived on the streets for years. Slept on the bridges in abandoned buildings, anywhere I could find. No one wanted to give me any job or offer any help. People thought I had mental issues. I even had a beg to survive. Most of the time I would feed from leftovers in the dustbins. Hunger would drive me insane. The greater pain was not starving and having nowhere to call home. The real pain was not knowing who I am. It's the worst disaster to befall anyone. 
had so many questions but no answers. That wasn't the first time I was being chased by those men in all these years. I didn't know who they were or what they wanted. Perhaps they thought I was a madman and wanted to take me to a psychiatric home. Or they were just organ harvesters looking for prey. That was the fifth time people tried to capture me like that. I became very scared. I needed to get up the streets find somewhere I'll be hidden. That was how I arrived at the park. Hey! Who is that? Hey, 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 hey. Go, 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 go back, go back! Go back! What do Go back! <gasps> Leave here! I'm talking to you, you're watching me! Leave here! What do you want here? What? What, what are you holding? What do you see? Oh, you're a thief? Oh, so you came here to stay? Yeah. What? Hey! You're a thief? Wait. You're, you're not mad? No. I'm homeless. I just need someone to stay. What, what do you say? Come again, please. I'm homeless. I need somewhere to stay. You are homeless? You need somewhere to stay? Okay, for your mind now, here is a, a, a refugee camp. Okay? Here looks like a refugee camp to you. As I'm talking to you now, my brother, myself, I need somewhere to stay. I can't help you, please. Please. Mm -mm. Go, go, go. Mm -mm. Please, go. No. no, if I go back to the streets, they're going to get me and think I'm mad. Don't get me off the streets and think I'm mad. I, I, just, I, just, I just don't like it. I don't, I don't like this feeling at all. I hate it when people start to beg me. I feel like you are infringing on my rights. You are abusing me now. No, yes, you are, you are abusing me whenever people beg me. It's like they are, they are abusing me. I can't help you, my brother. Hmm? Just leave, leave this park. Huh? Be, please, be going. Imagine the vulnerability. Yes, look, 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 you are looking like a madman now. Please, please, go, 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 go. Let me go. Ah, wait. Shoot, shoot, shoot. Come on. Come, come. Be, be coming. Be on now. <clears throat> um. <sighs> Jesus, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't like this thing. I don't like this thing. This is, it's late. At night, when you, when, when you try to help people at night, that is very dangerous. See, the reason why I'm standing here confidently is because you know how black belts. That's why, you know, like, I don't want to shake. It's not, it's not nice when you are helping people at night. You understand? It's very dangerous. You look dangerous now. See, the thing is, uh, here is a pack. Okay? I can do whatever you want. I can clean, I can feed the animals. I can do anything. I just want to work, please. <sighs> nah. See, now, the way you are looking, you are looking very weak. Oh. Can you? See, the thing is, my brother, see, here is a pack. Here is a big pack. You know? And even if I, I if I if I allow you to come in, uh, I decide to help you. I can't pay you. We are not going to pay you. And uh, we are going to feed you one once a day. And that day, self, I will be eating with you. I agreed. Hope you don't eat too much. Because me now, people who eat too much, it's like they, they are a threat to me. They are like a threat to me. Oh man, like you. Look at, look at the way. You, 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 you need a bab. Don't you cut your hair. Cut have mustache everywhere. Don't fool everywhere. I'm just imagining your armpits now. What a bombshell. Hmm. Um, I can't share my banana with you. Have you eaten this night? You have no eaten. Don't worry. We are fasting. Me say I'm, I'm fasting. No? I'm fasting. So don't worry. Yeah. 
Sit down. Be sitting down. Lost. Where, where were you coming? Where are you coming from? Street. Street. I'm sorry you went through all of this. You survived all of this. And all along I, I thought you were in the US. I tried to, to contact you. I sent you a message on, on Instagram. Wow. It, said, it said you were no longer active. I didn't even get a chance to bury them. They're gone forever. How am I gonna get them? It's okay. How am I gonna get them back, Kazito? Okay, it's okay, Lucas. It's okay. Sorry, I'm sorry that you lost everything. Excuse me. I'm sorry, we will we'll try to recover everything you had in the US. Your transportation company is still running. We'll try to get that back. I assure you. My mother, my mother is all I, all I had. I should have, I should have told her we are coming. You know, but she should probably be thinking we are bad. We just, we just abandoned her. That's, that's what she's going to be thinking. I don't know what she's thinking. I have to find her. We'll go to her. Okay, we'll explain everything. And Juliet's father. I have to see Juliet's father as well. I'll go to them then. She said I should have told him that we are coming. I wanted to surprise okay. him. And you see. We shouldn't have even come in the first place. Look, it's okay. Please get a hold of yourself. Please. It's a good thing you have your memories back. Tell him what? That 
sure Jerry is the same person as his Kelvin. You're not the same person. Come on, stop lying to yourself, Scarlett. We both saw the picture with Kizito. That was Jerry. I remember when we went to adopt him. They told us that his parents were involved in a ghastly accident. And he was exactly two years old then. It is very obvious that that scar on Jerry's face was as a result of that accident. Can you just stop? Stop it! Nobody is going to take my son away from me. Jerry is my son and nothing will stop that. I know. I know, okay? But you need to relax. Tega deserves to know the truth. He needs to know that he is the biological father of Jerry. That man is broken. I, I, I could see through him. I could feel his pain. What about my own pain? What about my own pain? Take I would take Jerry away from me. Can't you see it? You don't even care about my feelings. Just shut up! Shut up! Don't say anything! Shut up! I think it's time for you and your husband to leave. I need to go pick my son from school! Leave! Okay, okay, I, I, I will. I said leave! I you. Nobody will take my son away from me! Nobody! Scarlett, just go. <laughs> leave my house now! I said leave! 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 Leave my house! Leave! I need to go get my son from school. about our best friends. I told all my classmates about you. You what? I told my classmates about you. That I was your best friend? Yes. Okay. It's been two weeks since you regained your memory. What's, what's your plan? What's the next step? I've been in communication with Kizzy to what happened. Feedback is positive. We're going to get the money back from the US. So he's speaking with the lawyers. They sent an email. 
But I, I think it's better you return to the U.S. and, and start afresh instead of here. Yeah, I'm still mourning. Scarlett should have seen my mother. She couldn't take it. Juliet's father? The man was torn apart. When I told him about his daughter and grandson, it was easy. Tell you, I'm, I'm, I'm really sorry you had to go through all of that. Most people wouldn't have survived. But look at you. You are alive. You're here today. So it's time for you to pick yourself up and start afresh. I'm, I'm going to start afresh. But well, what I'm saying is, I can start afresh anywhere else. It doesn't have to be in the States. Besides, I've grown very fond of this family. You, your son, I just can't pick up my bag and leave. So, are you saying you you rather stay back here and do gate man duties than go back to the U.S.? No, that's not what I'm saying. What I'm saying is, when I get the money, I'll start something. But. How does that? I, I, I thought we had something. Take it. Look, stop, stop deceiving yourself. Don't think anything would happen between us because we, we just had an ordinary kiss. There's nothing. Nothing is going on. It wasn't an ordinary kiss. Scarlet, that wasn't an ordinary kiss. Well, it was a very short kiss, but definitely wasn't ordinary. That kiss in my soul. I didn't feel it. Did you or did you not feel it? Take a go back to the US. Do what's best for you. Go back. Just a minute. Hmm? I'll call you when I'm done, okay? Your, 
what? Scarlet. Joey's mother. The doctor said my womb can't carry a child. My husband left me where he got the news. Even though we were told surrogacy was an option, he left me. I was hurt. I was paid. I almost died of depression. But my friend Dobra stood by me. She consoled me. And she advised that I adopt a child. At least someone that can give me the joy of motherhood. I adopted Jerry. He was two years old when I adopted him. Dabra and I went to the orphanage home together. We were told his, his father died on the spot and the accident. And the mother gave up at the hospital she was rushed to. I felt so much for this innocent child who was orphaned at an innocent age. And I believed I was meant to be his mother. And he's been my happiness ever since. Scarlett, listen, so how do you know that he's my son? How do you know? The picture of Kizito's phone. That was Jerry, the picture. Kelvin is Jerry. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. No. That was how he got the scar from the accident. And he's been having nightmares about it. I don't know how to tell him he experienced it. Stop why you've been keeping him away from me. Yes, I was. I was scared. I was scared you would take him away from me. I did not want to tell you, but I could not. I could not do such a wicked thing to you. That's not who I am. I don't want to lose my son. Take him, please. Don't take him away from Scarlet, me. Scarlet, stop! How can I take a son away from his mother? I can never do that. You are his mother. Hey. Both of us can be his parents. I love you, Scarlet. And I'm sure you have something for me as well, don't you? You can't love me, Tega. I can't bear your children. But we already have a child. We already have him. Besides, you said surrogacy was an option, isn't it? We can always have children. Always. You would go that route with me. What? I'll go any route with you. <laughs> You're a good woman, Scarlett. You took care of him like he was your son. You took care of me when no one was there. You even kissed me when I was nobody. I'll go any route with you. I love you, Scarlett. <laughs> Should I take? <laughs> 
this thing. Give a look like it. I just this Honey. Honey. <sighs> there is um, something I, I want to tell you. Mr. Tega oh, P. Is your ah. father. Is it true? Yes. I'm your father. But you said to my father is in heaven. Yes, honey. I I thought he was. But he's here now. And he's your father. Come here. When you grow older, you'd understand things better, okay? Thank you so much, Scarlett. Thank you. So, so I can call you dad now. Yes. Yes, you can. Yes, you call me dad. Scarlet, my red rose. I always stood beside the still waters, thinking in them I'll find hope. And then you came along. You turned my life around. You made me find myself again, when no one else would. I promise and I vow to cherish you and always be true. Lucas, I thank my stars for bringing me to this place because it led me to you. You gave me hope when I had none. You're my safe place. Say after me. I. I. Call your name. Lucas Kaderi. Take thee to be my wife. Take thee, Scarlett Okoye, to be my wife. Before God and these wonderful witnesses. Before God and these wonderful witnesses. I promise to be a faithful and true husband. I promise to be a faithful and true husband. I, I, Scarlett Okoye, take thee, call his name, take thee, Lucas Kadiri, to be my husband, before God and these wonderful witnesses, before God and these wonderful witnesses, I promise to be faithful, I promise to be faithful, respectful, respectful, and true wife to you.
By the power vested in me, I proclaim you husband and wife in the name of the Father, in the name of the Son, and the name of the Holy Spirit. You may kiss your bride. I could call home Until you shone your light on me Just like a rainbow I saw Nothing but cloudy skies still I looked into your eyes You took all the sadness You raised all the madness Just like a rainbow I got A glimpse of paradise And hoping you realize That you make my heart glow Now watch our love grow Just like a rainbow Prison of my mind till you set me free. I didn't believe that I could feel the way that I feel until you showed me your love on me. Just like a rainbow, I saw nothing but cloudy skies. Still, I looked into your eyes. You took all the sadness, you raised all the madness. Just like a rainbow, I got a glimpse of paradise. Our love grow just like a rainbow I saw Nothing but cloudy skies Still, I looked into your eyes You took all the sadness, you raised all the madness Just like a rainbow I got A glimpse of paradise Hoping you realize That you make my heart glow Now watch our love grow just like a rainbow